Ooh, chat. I've only seen two of these. I just found that Cholula has like six different flavors. They have a chili garlic, which I've never seen. Uh, a, ch a chili I, I lime. I might have fallen asleep. I'm still up to talk music later, though, if you are still up. Ooh. Um, this is my day off, so I might be up working on things and shenanigans. So. Green pepper and sweet habanero. Mmm, yum. Probably after stream, we'll, we'll 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 talk music. We'll talk music. Oh, that bottle? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's that's like that's like three bucks. Yeah. Lucky to. What? Yeah, there. Chat. There's a lot I can complain about the U.S. and I will complain, but. One of them is not how cheap it is to get goods. When an American like complains about how everything is expensive, I just shrug my I just shake my head. <laughs> no, there is like it's 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 dependent, right? Because there are some things here that is like unreasonably expensive compared to everywhere else, right? Vera my friend be Vera my friend. I'm going to tell you right now, as someone who does look at American prices and pays attention to American news, you cannot compete with a Canadian. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me actually lower this. This is blasting in my ears. Let me... Okay, repeat that again. Okay. I, I do pay attention to American prices and American politics, and also I used to grow up with Prices Right. So I do understand American prices. Let me tell you this right now. You cannot play the things are expensive game with a canadian okay but does your does like how much you get paid like line up with like shit your he, prices shit he he put well okay so you had you got me for the first half then the second half got you so the average pay uh wage well it differs between each province like each state okay. um God, I actually got to remind myself. It's been a while. Uh, it, they right. they have been good with updating every couple of every like six months, right? Uh, but that's also because everything has also gone up. Uh, yeah, because a lot of lots of inflation and stuff going on right now. Canadian. Oh, so blue and final form, final form frog. I'm happy. Hey, I'm happy y'all can hop on in the stream. Counterpoint. Healthcare costs. That's what Blue said. Don't die. Don't get injured. All right, listen. <laughs> it's unfair, though. Like, getting healthcare is almost impossible. Like, literally, they. I feel like it's a ploy for the U.S. to be like, cool, we want some of y'all to die off, so we're going to make this, like, very difficult to obtain. I, that, that's not a theory. That's just the truth of, of capitalism. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> die or give us money. Oh, you're too poor. Do it. Well, we'll get rid of you so we can get a new crop of middle age. Right, right. I'm just like, come on, bro. So the European counterpoint, free healthcare. That's not a counterpoint. You're just <laughs> proving the original point. The fuck you mean counterpoint? So <laughs> the federal minimum wage of Canada. As of April 1st, oh, 2021. So this is not, oh, wait, no, no, no. This, yeah, yeah. It's 17.30 per hour. Oh, that's like above normal minimum wage here. I know. But let me look at the normal cost of living. Right, right. Because it's also, I'm guessing it's like everywhere, right? Like the more metropolitan the area is, the more expensive it is going to be to live there. Oh, yeah. No, absolutely. And that's the same with the U.S., I guess. Oh, absolutely. Like, literally, it's to live. Like, um, one time, uh, I think in um, a part of New York City, um, I lived in a basically an attic, pretty much. Like, it was literally an attic room. It was small. The... The shower was basically a closet, um, no kitchen, just a room, bathroom, or whatever. That was $1,000 a month for that rinky-dink attic. Oh, I I, I understand that. Uh, so, uh, the metropolitan city I'm near, Vancouver, I just, uh, I just got up and I just got an article from this year. A one-bed apartment 
will cost an average of two point two thousand. Yeah. Me when ch Twitch chat stares at my chesticles. Three bed apartment is an average three point seven. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's it's fucking expensive, yo. Know? It's 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 ridiculous. <laughs> well, I I also do live in uh like this isn't me saying this is actually statistically speaking the most expensive city in Canada. That would make sense. Wait, what? The did CJ add some new shit when I wasn't paying attention? Message effects gigantify an emo. Wow. Okay, here. Average home price is uh one mi one point two million. Average buying a home? Yeah, no, that actually checks out. That makes sense. Yep. Yeah. Oh no, the 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 real estate uh market in all of BC is a big big political problem. Uh, we have a lot of foreign uh. Uh, uh, advisors come in they'll buy land and hire a manager so they'll never so they, they'll never set foot in even the country but they have uh, properties and they have land in BC and uh, it became such a big problem and such a big uh, like corporation problem where like BC a couple years ago actually had to like put a 10 year ban on uh foreign uh uh foreign markets buying real estate. Wait, 10 years you said? No, it was 5 years. I I was just oh, I was right, just right. <laughs> I was just wishing for 10. Oh my god. Like I can t like mainly it's kind of like here or it sounds like it's majorly apartment based because most people most people are like afraid to get homes because most of the time when people do apply for homes they got to get a loan and then that sets them back and no one really wants to get a loan they have to pay for it for years and uh, yep. all that and I, like shoot even I'm right now pay trying to pay off a loan and it was literally just to survive in an apartment oh yeah it's ridiculous